Mezzanine is back with another fantastic production this week. It's called Sea March. John Martin live in the newsroom with a preview. Good morning, John. Good morning, Justin and Kimberly. Absolutely, the, the, they were they were so kind to come to us this morning, so we can stay in the in the warm environment. First time this week, so thank you for braving the weather and, oh, and coming pleasure. here. I'm with Christopher and Mara, the stars of Sea Marks. It's a story about an Irish fisherman who falls in love. Who's the Irish fisherman? Uh. <laughs> uh, talk a little bit about this performance and the history of it. I mean, there's a really neat backstory uh, just about you two in this performance. Uh -huh. Well, we've loved the play for a very long time. It is a poignant story. It's funny. It's two people who are an unlikely match. And at the same time, they're soulmates. So I first found this play more than 30 years ago. Really wanted to do it. Didn't have a theater. Didn't have a co-star. He also had the play. Was looking for a co-star. A mutual friend, my manager, introduced us. So we said, you know, how do you do? And drove to a theater about four hours north. We were in Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. So there's a place called the Central Coast of California. So we went to a beautiful little playhouse there, did the show, um, ran it for the summer. And, you know, there was so much synergy about this piece and us that we've continued to find out through the years. He has Irish roots. I have Welsh roots. Our characters, I'm from Wales, he's from Ireland. And the whole experience is sort of sprinkled with these interesting moments and, and synergies. Mm -hmm. So, He's a primitive man. <laughs> he lives on an island that mm -hmm. has no roads. There's only one light bulb, and that's at the captain's. That's the registered pub. Ah, very good. Well, of course, ask me that. And it's always <laughs> a sea wind ah. blowing. Yeah. It's, uh, he's a fish out of water when he gets to the city. But he falls in love with this girl, and he, he pursues her through letters. So the, a big part of this is a letter writing back and forth for a year and a half. It's, uh, it's The, very, the very written good. word, another lovely thing. Um, yeah. Are we losing it these days? Um, the poignancy, um, expressing yourself, distilling your emotions and your feelings, and putting everything you possibly can on the page, and then sending it off magically and does it land and he mm -hmm. says later was i writing to who i thought i was writing to and mm -hmm. who are we really then when we meet because we've made up you know these people in our heads and and then we have to adjust to well who are you really and <laughs> yeah, right. Can't, yeah right it's almost so. it was, and it's, it's almost transferable to to something like a like I don't want to make it online dating this it, these well, days. No. It really is. So but it, it the, is kind of similar. The story kind yeah. of, yeah. Um, so it's, it's happening at the Mezzanine Thursday through Sunday. Obviously, for tickets, you can go on themezcos.com. We're going to have uh -huh. uh, perhaps a piece coming up here in just a little bit. Um, so stick with us throughout the hour, and uh, we'll have more from these lovely actors and ac actor and actresses. Actors. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll get my stuff together. But that's coming up here in just a little bit, guys. But for now, back to you. All right, interesting. Thanks, John. And sea Marks is the story of an Irish fisherman who falls in love with a woman he has only seen once. The production being held at the Mezzanine in downtown Colorado Springs. The folks lovely enough to come here and join John Martin with a preview in the newsroom. Good morning, guys. Good morning, Justin and Kimberly. Absolutely. Starting Thursday through Sunday. I'm just going to read the hours off real quick. 6.30 on both. Thursday and Friday, 2 p.m. on Saturday and Sunday. Uh, this is Mara Pearl and Christopher Law. You're actually going to be performing a piece for from C. Marks. Uh, this is a scene from when they first met. I will step out of the way. Call him. At last. What? Uh, at last. I do remember you now. At the punch bowl. Can I get your song? No, thank you. A cup of tea, then. Ah, have some punch. It's not that strong. It's done nothing for me. <laughs> Did you want it to? Yes. Because of meeting me? Well, I suppose. Why? Well, that's just the thing about me. Every time I'm about to meet a lady I've been writing to for a year and a half, I'm up to take a drop or two. <laughs> <laughs> and did it help you this time? I don't know, really. Am I different from how you remember me? Uglier. <laughs> <laughs> and so are you. <laughs> well, for the longest time, I, I never saw you. And 
I began to wonder if who I was corresponding with was who I was corresponding with. And in your letters, you always seemed alone. And you're not married. And you're not 20 anymore, Anne. <sighs> Can I get you something to drink? Whiskey. Whiskey? Yes, please. <laughs> That's great. Barb Pearl, Christopher Law, this is a scene from Seamarks happening at the mezzanine. Thank you very much. You're going to be here throughout the morning, and we'll hear more from them. And this, the rich history uh, between these two, first performing this 30 years ago. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then coming again to the mezzanine this weekend. Tickets are only $10 for those tickets. You can go to the mezcos.com. Justin and Kimberly. I believe uh, it's your scene next. Oh, all <laughs> so right. we have to sit here and do that same scene. Yeah, okay. I can't do an Irish accent <laughs> exactly. at all. Yeah, Justin will do the Irish accent. <laughs> I can have whiskey. Can I, can I have whiskey? <laughs> well, is that literally, they were talking. We were talking about the cues earlier. They're like, John, the word is whiskey, and I was like, what? Where? What? <laughs> <laughs> right, right. So apparently, no, it's just regular coffee. Keeps right us now. warm in the winter, right? But all we're right. getting there. All right. Bye. Thanks, Johnny. Appreciate Thank it. You. That's good stuff. They're I very know, very yeah. talented.